Hey guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all well. This is the start of a new what I eat in a few days. I don't really feel like I've been doing that many of these videos. I'm back to it now. Ignore the really ugly orange patchy tan. I did it yesterday and I still just haven't washed it off. I've literally been on nearly like 16 hours. So I look a little bit ridiculous, as you can see. I'm gonna show you what I have pretty much every day for breakfast. And if I'm not having it, it's because I'll be out or something. Like this is literally my go-to at the minute and I just find it so yummy. If you know me, you know I love of like a nice little like fruit and chocolatey sort of mix so every day it's the mini Weetabix with chocolate chips and then I have some blueberries, strawberries and raspberries and it literally just like fuels my day and then typically speaking I actually don't really get hungry for a few hours after that so you know it really fills you up sometimes I do for the majority of the time it leaves me not like thinking oh I need more food for like you know a few hours or whatever so it's good and it's yummy and I love it <laughs> I literally love it. Like, I've never ever been a weed Bix gal, but this just hits diff. Like, with the fruit. If I didn't have it with the fruit, I probably wouldn't enjoy it. But together, it's like the perfect combo. Just make sure you're washing your fruit because there's so many little worms and dirt in there that we don't want in our bodies. It's literally five hours later and I'm starving. I'm on the train going to London. I found this in my handbag from when I went to Manchester in a club chocolate bar. It's the only thing I've got right now. I didn't plan this, I just was rushing around very exposed in my top. Okay guys, I'm in London. I just had an absolute mare. First of all, let's just appreciate the view because I feel so happy right now. Like, look at that, there's a Shake Shack. Never even heard of Shake Shack. You know I have, but in America. And it looks all bougie. I thought it was like a fast food thing. Look at this. I've been to London a few times, but never have I ever seen this. Like, this is freaking gorgeous. The place is called the Palm House that I'm going, and we're here. And that looks freaking amazing as well. I don't know why I'm just so happy. Like, this is so cool. I am 15 minutes early. I had a nightmare. I thought that you just, like, find your tube times on the, like, train line app, but it took me to a completely different stop. Like, I don't know if I was being stupid, but I got on a line that's meant to take you to Tottenham Court Road, and it ended up taking me to Embankment, and that was the last stop. So I was like, brilliant, well, I've got to get off here unless I want to go back. Oh my God, what is going on right now? I'm just going to have to go in because this is ridiculous. I had no service on my phone and I was scared that I wasn't going to know where to go and that would have been really stressful. But I'm going to put you away and I'll let you know when I next eat, guys. See you in a bit. Oh my God, look at these people. They just had a limbo competition. Guys, so much dancing going on. Hi, vlog. Oh, brilliant. Brilliant. Absolutely love that when that happens. Brilliant. Well, now they've just gone in front of me because I was stupid and I didn't think anyone was going to come behind me. So I just went behind this person because usually when it's late at night, only one person's on the thing. But I bet you now my bad luck will let them have their freaking order first. Oh, come on. Let's get in there. Come on. Oh my God, no. He's literally already done his order. Amazing. I love being smart. I love being smart. Uh, what should I get for you? Hiya. Can I get a uh, six chicken nugget large meal, please, with a Diet Coke? Yeah, what dips would you like? Just ketchup, please. Yeah, anything else? Do you have just the side portion of the nacho cheese wedges? Yeah, yeah I'll have one of them, please. Is that everything? Yeah, that's it, thanks. Let's we know them, please. Thanks. I can decide whether to get a McFlurry or not, but if I want to make sweet afterwards, I'll just have a Mars ice cream at home or something. Do you know what I mean? You know what you girls like. Maybe I did pack a hoodie, a comfy bra, Crocs, and make it wipes for the journey back. Maybe I did, because I like to be a comfy queen. There's no way I'm traveling back in a bra. Oh the hard thing I am and also makeup like makeup like eyebrow gel makes your eyebrows so freaking uncomfortable like mascara when you can feel it and like you feel like it's all like on your face well I don't know what's going on but makeup wipes are just a must a must yep makeup wipes are a must they're a necessity they're not a want they are a need in situations like this get them at McDonald's today has not been a very realistic day in the life to be honest I mean how often do I go to an event never I think I've only ever been to two events and they've been my protein ones this hasn't been a very realistic in the day realistic in the day realistic day in the life while I was at this event I ate like one of those little mini burgers that you saw in the thing and then I also ate a beef skewer love that and then I had one bite of this like pork taco thing I was talking to this girl and literally I just eat 
eating the whole time I was talking to her and I was literally had my mouth full of food the whole time so I thought maybe I shouldn't have that last bite and then I probably had about seven of the drinks there because this event was about the drinks it's basically like non-alcoholic spirits so it's basically just like juice so I, I had like about seven juices I've had a lot of sugar basically all right it was 10 p.m I've got a headache I've got to drive to mine get my stuff then drive to Ben's we never stay at Ben's we're trying to stay at Ben's but oh god I'm really awkward that my camera's there oh no I hope my apple pay works I've got a new card oh god oh yeah Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> ben said he doesn't want any food or a drink or anything, not even a drink. Like, I double checked, do you want a drink? And he said no. But no, I feel like I should have gotten something anyway. Like, he said no like three times, but I still feel like I should have gotten something probably. I'm like reaching over so you can see me. Because, like, if I said no, I still want him to bring something back. It's too late now. Hey, yeah. Thank you. I find it such hard work driving around a drive through like with the clutch and everything. Like it kind of hurts. Thank you. Have you got any salt and ketchup, please? Salt and ketchup? Yeah, I do. Hi, bro. Thank you. I will be eating in my car, even though I haven't seen Ben in like four days, but I, I just, you know what I'm like with my food. I want to eat my food now. And this is making me want to do a drive with me, but I think that's a little bit dangerous. The only exception I'll make is going around a drive through If I'm like singing, because then I don't need to like look at the camera. I mean, I don't need to look at the camera if I'm just talking, but you know. Okay, so why is there no M on my bag? Oh, there literally is. I'm literally lying to you. Grab a bit of this bag and put my gum in it. Amazing. I'm so excited. Oh God, I don't know what it is. This just looks heavenly to me. I literally didn't eat a Mackey's in like two weeks. And then I had a Mackey's yesterday and today. Love that from me. The chip the cold, but we can still have a really yummy meal, even if it's cold. And it doesn't make the meal bad or anything wrong with it or not worthy of eating it or whatever it is. Still happy I've got the food. Six chicken nuggets, some nacho cheese bites. I actually have never tried these before, so I might do a little taste test now for you guys. I do get the mozzarella dippers. The ones I like the most was the garlic ones, I think. The garlic cheese bites. Oh, they're like in little triangles. Oh, a bit like chili, like curry sort of thing, which isn't my vibe. Yeah, I will still eat them. Isn't that cho cheese like known to be like spicy? It's not even spicy, but it's just like curry sort of flavor. Oh well, I'll still eat them. I'ma eat my food, drench in salt, and I'll get back to you when I actually eat. Peace out, guys. Oh my god, that lettuce looks so good. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, so as you would have seen, I went to TGI's. Basically, my sister messaged me asking me what I'm doing today and said she really fancied TGI's. So then I got TGI's in my head. And then she actually ended up going to the carvery with my granddad. So he said, we're going to go tomorrow. You guys know me. As soon as something's in my head, I have to have it. Like, I literally have to then have it. There's no way I cannot. And it's really stressing me out that now I'm going to have TGI's today and tomorrow. But that's okay. It's fine. This video is very unrealistic like few days in my eating life that makes it realistic in a way like it almost shows you that not every day is going to go as you wanted it like i don't really want to have two tgis consecutively in a row but sometimes that's just how the world works and that's okay we're actually at five guys now i'm here with ben ben's just standing there waiting for the food but i'm still really full from my tgis and i want to have snacks at the cinema because else i get bored like i love eating at the cinema i don't know why my lips are purple in here it's really weird i'm kind of cold so maybe that's why i need to eat snacks at the cinema and I've already had like my savoury fix of the day. Ben's just getting his bag on fries and then we're gonna go to the cinema. We're watching, I don't actually remember what it's called. It's got the rock in it though, so that should be really good. I've got a Diet Coke and whenever I get a Diet Coke and they put a lime in it, I always squeeze my lime in it. So I actually got lime Diet Coke, it's nice. It kind of tastes like a Bocca and Coke, which I don't like. So yeah, that's the current situation. I've got my popcorn. I got sweet and salted, but mainly salted because I don't like when it's this one, isn't it? No, you said screen five. <laughs> I hope that's that way, babe. Screen six, D5 to D6. So yeah, I always get a sweet and salty, but I feel like the sweet's really overpowering, so I love the salted, so I get the mainly salted. We've got a share bag of 12 that I put in there, and like each layer, like I put a little bit more in, and then it's like, you've got the chocolate and the so popcorn. So you're calling like your head and not the popcorn? <gasps> Um, and then it's got water. So yeah, we're going to watch Black Adam. We don't really know what it's about. Got the rock in it. Hopefully it'll be a good film. You've got a bit of hair on top of your head that's not sticking up. Oh, that's quite normal to have hair on top of your head. But it sticks up. What's it? Hey. Do you want to go for like a mohawk with one piece of your hair? Maybe I am. No, yeah. When I was a little girl, I only grew hair in the middle of my head, so mum and dad used to make me have a mohawk. That's a bit strange, actually. You should then shave your head. Let's go, guys. Let's go I'll let you know afterwards what we, we think. We're gonna watch the um, trailers for movies. We never are on time or early, and we're actually on time, so we're gonna watch some trailers. Bye, guys.
another day, another Weetabix and fruit. So there isn't that many Weetabix left, but I am going for lunch in literally two hours. I didn't go to sleep till really late last night. So when I don't go to sleep till really late, I don't set an alarm. Like I just sort of like let myself like sleep through. Although my sister did ring me at 10 and wake me up. I'm just gonna have the remainder of this. I've really been that many, but luckily because I am going for lunch in a couple of hours, it's not bothering me because I just need something just to like, you know, line the stomach. Got my blueberries, raspberries and strawberries. Honestly, these are like my favorite fruits. Up. Anybody would rather have a banana over like berries. I just don't know for you to be honest. I forgot these ones. I'm not going to wash them because I can't be bothered. And just like that, breakfast is served. I did put in the amount of milk that I'd have for a normal sized bowl. <laughs> now it just looks like milk and fruit. I literally can't show you because milk won't go all over you. I've also had a glaze package come through and a my protein package. I'm so excited for this my protein one because I got some stuff that I think is really cute in that. Last week I literally went to the gym like five days in a row and I haven't been for the past like three days. So all I'm trying to say is like there's no rules. You don't need to do what all these like fitness influencers say and like say like set out like a plan and everything. Go when you feel like it. I think I'll probably go this evening. There's no rules. I always get the same thing from Glaze when I do my brand deals with them. But it is amazing so I'm happy that I do. The Pearl Blonde Super Color Conditioning Gloss. It's literally amazing. Like the color it makes your hair is like unreal. I'm gonna save this for Instagram. So if you want to check out what I got, go check out my Instagram and use code Brooke at checkout for 50% off my protein. You're welcome. So I'm at TGI's again. I told you guys I was coming. This <laughs> on me, on you. Yeah, on you. <laughs> this has got the staple sesame strips. Oh. We were saying because I've come to, like twice, I should have tried something new, but I just don't she think I can do it. She didn't. I knew she was. Yeah, there's no way. And then mozzarella dippers. Like I, Sash doesn't like cheese. I like pizza. They just hit diff. Mozzarella doesn't actually taste of anything. It's with the breaded stuff around it. Extra Dark Daniels. Of course, one apple tea. Oh my, look at this. It just come into Primark. <gasps> the Christmas vibes. As soon as it turns November, it's officially Christmas. Look at this nanny. Love that. Oh my God. The Christmas vibes in here is just immaculate. Oh my God. Have you seen this, sis? <laughs> Cringe. Look, little doggy outfits. You need to get Harold and Harvey something. Look how cute. So it's currently half past 10 and I'm actually cooking myself a roast dinner. I've used like pre-sliced veg and stuff. I'm just cooking myself two sausages and a breast of chicken. I'm really hungry right now and I was gonna go to sleep. I'm really starving. I know that's not the right thing to do, but sometimes when you know it's effort to like cook, you just think, oh, sometimes you get your ED thoughts that come in and are like, oh, well, you go to sleep in like an hour. So you may as well just wait until the morning. Ben has talked me out of this stupid mindset. He basically wouldn't not let me come down and cook it. He was like, I'm not gonna keep pestering you until you go down and cook that food because I know you want it. He knew that it was my ED brain not letting me, you know? So basically forced me <laughs> to come and cook this. But I know I'm gonna really enjoy it because I, I am craving it. Just cooking away there. It's making me feel really guilty because I feel like I'm eating so much over the last few days. Not only that, but my brain is just like going crazy about that. And it's saying like, you shouldn't eat, you've been eating like loads of unhealthy food. I know what's right and I know what's wrong. Like, Stop. If I'm hungry, like my tummy's literally growling, I've got a headache, I have really low energy, I'm anxious, like my body is literally telling me to go and eat, so I need to listen to that. Okay, so everything's served. I've got sausages, breast of chicken, three little Yorkshire puddings, carrots, cauliflower, sprouts, and broccoli. Obviously gravy. So yeah, salt and pepper, a must. I'm gonna dig in now. Morning, friends. It's another day. Another Weedabix, raspberries, blueberries, strawberries, and milk. I did pick this, which is really naughty of me, but I do pick something every day because I just can't help it. I just love picking it. Picking it, picking up my skin. I did deadlifts yesterday at the gym and oh my god, I've never gone that freaking heavy, like ever, with my weights. My whole body's in pain. Like usually I'll get some pain after doing like a leg day or something. Right now my legs are fine. I literally did like a really intense leg day. I put all my weights up. I was literally like grunting, profusely sweating. I was going all out and I thought I'd do some deadlifts, just pop them in there and I, I up my weight. I did, I think I did 60 kilograms, which for me is quite a lot. Like I think I usually do like four Oh my god, my lower back is like, oh my god, I feel like I'm gonna look like The Rock tomorrow. Like, it's in that much pain. Like, it's wild and up here. Like, it's kind of like a really good feeling though. This is my breakfast. I'm gonna tuck in. It looks super yummy. I've been sort of out of routine for the last few days, so I'm gonna get back on track today. And that'll make me feel really good. See you later, guys. <laughs> I'm now back. I'm gonna have a Mars ice cream. I didn't want to talk in my early video because I was in Varas. Don't be in Varas. But now I'm gonna eat my Mars ice cream. I feel like I need something sweet after a savory meal. And then you just hit this. Oh, 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 
Okay, no. No. No, my throat is all burning. I inhale chocolate. Oh, that sounds like a dream <coughs> for you. Now it's like my throat is sore. Oh, I still got my like garlicky weird taste, so another one it is. So I then forgot to record, but I actually ate a share bag of crisps. They're like potato sticks that are from like Morrison's or something. Yeah, nice big hefty bag of them. Time to eat with Eden, cha cha cha. Ignore my spots, I just pop them, which is really naughty of me, but when they're white, I just can't help it. Another day, another Weedabix. Strawberries, raspberries, and blueberries. They're just so freaking good. Nice big bowl of fuel right here, boys and gals. This is what I'm gonna eat for my brekkie, of course. Would you expect any different? I'm gonna have a couple of wraps. I'm gonna have one with chicken in it and one with some prawns. We don't actually have any salad. I mean, the salad we do have is really moldy. So I'm gonna go and ask my nan if she's got any lettuce and cucumber because that's what I want with it. I couldn't decide which meat to have, so I'm gonna have one with each. Hopefully the chicken isn't too much for one wrap. I'm just gonna have a really big wrap. Lay some oil on. I've been using Piri Rub. I'm actually gonna use some paprika and garlic salt just because we've run out. But hopefully this is still nice. Chicken breast in, some lettuce, <laughs> some cucumber, just like that. I'm gonna put a little bit of mayo on as well. We're just gonna have prawns. That is for my lunch, guys. Really rubbish at wrapping wraps, so let's see how I can do. Not too shabby, right? I'm not actually sure how they're meant to look. Like sometimes I really like really overfill them and then there's just no way I'm wrapping them. Are you meant to somehow wrap the end or? That was just pure wrap. So guys, here's my dinner. I've got a large, thin and crispy pizza from Domino's. And then I've also got 14 chicken strippers. Obviously had to get the large garlic dip because if you're not doing that, I just don't know for you. And obviously barbecue dip as well. Probably am gonna need more of this barbecue dip because it's just so fucking yummy. And the reason it's in this is because I've just put it in the Argo to heat up because the delivery guy literally took like 40 minutes to get home. It's a 10 minute drive. I went for the thin and crispy one because I've had the Italian one before and it was still literally really thick and I quite like a thin pizza. This is what I'm having for now. Me and Benny are going to be watching the David Brent documentary. Well, it's a mockumentary, apparently. That's what we're going to do now. Oh, straight, yeah. <laughs> if you're not getting Domino's cookies when you get a Domino's takeaway, then you're doing it wrong, aren't you, babe? Yeah. So I did just heat them up in the meat while they? Because if you don't do that, then you're also doing it wrong, aren't they, babe? Yes. <laughs> I'm kind of so full, but I was really hungry to begin with. So we got one each. Gonna eat now. Look how good that looks. Oh, Bucky, you've not kept it on camera what you're eating. I know. I'm a fraud. I am a liar. I I am an actress. I'm so sorry. I'm halfway through eating my breakfast, but you guys already know I've had for breakfast because I've had it every single day. Lift it up, lift it my up. My Weedabix with chocolate chips, raspberry, blueberries, and strawberries. And now that I'm thinking of it, I actually eat it really oddly. Look, I eat it like this half first and then this half, look. Can you see? Yes. So yeah, just eating my breakfast. My breakfast. Peace out, homies. We've both got an Oreo milkshake. Yours looks so much more appetizing, but I just don't like whipped cream. <laughs> Mine just looks really plain. Look at the boys. They're all cold though, because they've been in the rain. Look. Oh, it's on his nose. So cute. The guy said that this is banging. <laughs> is it nice? That is really nice. Mate, sister Jenny has to do the core clip thing. Core clip. It's not really exactly. Do you? It's nice, but <laughs> it kind of tastes a bit warm. Can you just taste that milk? I mean, it's nice. I mean, yeah, no, it's I've not. got all my toppings on, maybe. Yeah, you can mix in your whipped cream. It's nice, though. I'm just being sassy. <laughs> I've got chicken bites. Sis has fish bites, but they literally look the same. Anyway, we're going to dig in. This looks really yummy, to be honest. Really, nice. really, they look like Mackey's fries. Yeah. And they also brought over a really big bowl of fries that we just split in half. So we probably had, like, double of what we had again of fries. And then fries were like, ah. Absolutely banging. Oh, obviously it's a little bit later on now. Me and Benny and Benny's dad have come to the car break. I think I'm gonna get turkey because I always get turkey. Yolk's pudding. Yolk's pudding is a necessity. Both potatoes, I'm trying to get the crispy ones. I get carrot, sprouts, cabbage. I get like this potato bake and cauliflower cheese. Hey there, y'all. It's me back and better than ever, Biarch. <laughs> My skin is really bad right now. Honestly, I don't know what is going on with it. A little bit of reality for you right now. Bear in mind, this camera has a smooth skin thing on it. So did you see that contrast there? Don't believe everything you see on social media, all right? I think you thought that you were amazing. I've got do. <laughs> I didn't eat my two from yesterday, because obviously you guys saw I got some of yesterday. I had two of them yesterday, so now I've got to do now. <laughs> what was that, darling? Two. And then I've also got this Mars ice cream, but I'm trying to steal it off me, which is really no, rude. I steal it from you. I had two. <laughs> you wanted one. <laughs> I 
this is what I'm having for my dessert. But I think I'm gonna wrap up the video there, to be honest. I do think that on Tuesday, I think, so I do think I've only done five days, no, six days. Thanks for my ice cream. Cheers, mum, for the money. This is what I'm gonna eat now. I mean, if I eat anything else for the rest of the day, I'll let you know, but I've obviously had to heat up these cookies because they're just so delicious when they heat up. I love you all so much. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video and hopefully it made you feel a little bit better or you've just enjoyed it for entertainment purposes or whatever it may be. Have an amazing week. I love you all lots. You're a hashtag amazing. Like, comment, and subscribe. All my social will be linked in the description box below and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.